Hey everybody, G4 Video 5 here, and welcome back to some more Grand Theft Auto 3, the definitive edition in this part. We will be completing the mission Gone Fishing for Ray Mikowski. I think my partner's a rat! We gotta shut him up permanently! He goes fishing out of his boat near the lighthouse on Portland Rock most nights. Steal a police boat! Make sure his backstabbing plans are sunk. I want him sleeping with the fishes, not eating them. So this is a mildly interesting mission, as what we have to do is assassinate Ray's current police partner, because old Ray there's grown suspicious of him. And so, like any criminal in Liberty City, he wants to assassinate his problem with the help of Claude. And real quick, I want to point out that I just cut out the sequence in which I drove across the Callahan Bridge, because I really don't see a need to show that off once again. We know what the Callahan Bridge looks like, we know how annoying it is to traverse at times, so... Yeah, we are now here in Callahan Point, and the reason we're here is because there is a police boat here that is docked, and... <laughs> I love doing that jump. And um, we need to enter this boat in order to get Ray's partner to spawn into the map. Because if you know where Ray's partner is supposed to be, and you just drive straight to that location, then he won't actually be there until you enter that police boat. So now that we've done that, uh, I've exited the police boat, because I don't really want to use it for this mission. I mean, you could, because it does have those turrets attached to it, but they're very weak turrets and end up prolonging the process a bit more than I would like, personally. And you also have to deal with Ray's partner maneuvering out in the open waters and stuff and trying to dodge you. And I don't know, I just don't really want to deal with any of that. So I'd rather just head on over to Portland Harbor like we're doing to do this speed strat, which involves a sniper rifle and in my case also a rocket launcher because I don't have enough sniper rifle ammo to do this trick exclusively with a sniper rifle. But that's okay though, because either way, this is a faster method. And the reason why we're in Portland Harbor is because you get a bit of a vantage point on Ray's partner's current location by using these elevated edges here in Portland Harbor. So in this little corner of the area, we're going to pull out the sniper rifle to shoot at Ray's partner. And <laughs> you can see a little cutscene ends up playing here in which he starts throwing grenades out into the water because that's apparently how he fishes. And, I don't know, it's just a really silly thing there, but hilarious nonetheless. I, I, I always enjoyed that little cutscene there. And something really cool is that if the game glitches out on you, he can actually kill himself with his own grenade, and you end up passing the mission that way. So, <laughs> you know, uh, hopefully that happens to folks. It did not happen for me, so that's okay, though, because we still ended up taking care of him quite quickly there as he was approaching Portland Harbor's little corner area I was standing on, so that completes this part. It's not the most fun mission in my opinion, but, uh, you know, I do like that you can use a little speed strategy to expedite the process of completing it. But anyways, uh, real quick, I like how the cranes are active here in Portland Harbor. It kind of creates this sense of liveliness here, so I think that's pretty cool. But anyway, that completes this part. In the next part, we will be completing the next Ray Mikowski mission, which is called Plaster Blaster. So until then, I will see you next time. Mm -hmm.